Hi, this is Natalie Rydstrom and you're watching SBR Picks. Ninth place, Espanola suffering a poor run and ended this match with three consecutive losses, while seventh place and hosts Malaga's run has been patchy to say the least. Will we see another draw as in their last head-to-head -head, or will one team walk away with all three points? Stuart from Talking Tips has joined us now to take a look at Malaga versus Espanol. Stuart, thanks for being here. Hi. Now, the reverse match back in September saw a two-all draw. Uh, what are you expecting here? Um, I'm expecting a fairly tight match. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if it was another draw. I'm not expecting four goals in, though. So it's uh, going to be quite a bit tighter and a little bit less interesting, I think. OK. Well, we do have value on the three-way line. Uh, Malaga's price 2.1 uh, with Bet Victor there. Uh, 3.5 for the draw at Coral and four for Espanyol at Bet365. Will you be playing the winner's market? I'm not playing the winner's market, but if I was, I think I'd probably have to go for Espan uh, Sorry, for Malaga. Espanyol have been in such a, uh, a such poor form recently, and they've had one league away win from home this season. Um, I, I think it'd be very, very surprising if they managed to get another one here. Having said that, QPR did that last night, so you know things can be turned around at pretty much any point, and you know you never know. Yes, that's right. Um, now, you said you weren't expecting sort of the total of four goals as we saw in last meeting. Uh, the over is priced 2.2. The under is priced 1.67 there. Quite low. Uh, that's at bet 365. Uh, mm. Will you play uh, the total goals market? No, I'm not going to play the total goals market. I'm playing something reasonably similar, but not the total goals market. Uh, the main reason is, is I don't see either of these two having been brilliant goal scorers this season. And Malaga have a pretty strong defensive record at home. And uh, I think you can tell from the stats that Espanyol are not huge goal scorers away. So uh, it's going to be a tight game. I wouldn't expect a lot. Mm -hmm. Would you be more inclined to back both teams to score no uh, than both teams scoring? You're getting too good at this. We said last week, uh, yes, I would definitely be inclined to back both teams to score no. <laughs> <laughs> that wouldn't happen to be your, your prediction here, would it, for the match? That's exactly my prediction. You've done it again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Well, there you have it. Both teams to score no. Uh, that comes in 1.83 there. Bet365, very decent odds. Uh, Stuart is from TalkingTipsters.com. Stuart, before I let you go, briefly tell our viewers about Talking Tipsters. Uh, Talking Tipsters is all about finding the very, very best tipsters around and giving you our thoughts on them. Um, I, you know, I felt like to go into some fairly in-depth reviews and cover one aspect per part of the review. And I've got a six-part review going on at the moment. And uh, I've also just started putting on a load of pre-match stats for a number of games. So for all of the Premier League matches tonight, I've just put up a load of stats so you can go and have a look at those as well. OK, great stuff. I have put the link in the description uh, below this video, so uh, do be sure to check it out. Stuart, thank you for joining us today. Thank you.